Hi guys, welcome to Make 2 and a Sims free play video showing all the items you can buy at the maternity store, which is being added to the game as part of a brand new pregnancy update. Thanks to EA and Fire Monkeys for giving us early access so we can show the pregnancy update to you guys. We have separate videos explaining how pregnancy works in the game and also walking through the pregnancy event in a little more detail, so check the video description below for links to those. The Sims Free Play team is also doing a live stream about the pregnancy update on their official Facebook, so you can check it out there and I think also on their YouTube channel. And just to note, what we're showing in this video is only a temporary version of the game with currency and also maternity store tokens added by the game developers. This is not our game and we will not be keeping this game for ourselves. Now first of all, let's check out the maternity store location. If you saw our other videos about the pregnancy update, then this is familiar to you, but it's basically right here near the teen idol sign. If you've got the pregnancy event going on, there's also a button inside which says store and from there you can go directly into the store and see everything there is. You also know from our other videos that once you build the maternity store, this will begin the bumpy ride discovery quest and the first pregnancy event which will unlock pregnancy. All the clothing and items in the maternity store need to be paid for with tokens, which are earned by doing goals and tasks during the nine day pregnancy event. The store is divided into clothes and also furniture and decor. So we'll go ahead and start with the clothes and do a bit of a fashion event for you. There are two types of clothes, breezy and relaxed. Now for breezy, it says 15 items here, but I think it's actually 16 because we unlocked a top and trousers combo during the pregnancy quest. So the top and the trousers are two items on top of the 14 other clothing items in this set. So that'll be 30 items total. The important thing is that in order to get this first set of items, you'll need to first buy the seven pairs of trousers that you can see here. If you buy all of those, you will unlock this on the right, and here you'll have seven new tops to go along with those trousers. So let's go ahead and buy those. Again, the maternity store tokens that you see at the top here were given to us by the game developers in this temporary version of the game. It's not our game, and when the update comes out, we'll have to play pregnancy and earn these tokens just like everybody else. All right, so as you can see, we've unlocked this prize pack of tops. Now let's go ahead and buy the relaxed clothing set. As you can see, there's gonna be 14 total of these. It looks like seven of these shirt combinations. And if you buy all of those, we'll be able to unlock seven pairs of shorts. And there we go, we've unlocked the seven pairs of shorts. Now to get a look at the maternity clothes, we need an adult female sim who is pregnant. With her selected, we'll tap on a wardrobe and browse clothes. And as you can see, there is going to be a new tab in the wardrobe called maternity. And there are 30 new items of clothing since those are the ones that we have unlocked. These are all mix and match. So I'm just gonna tap through what we've got. A black t-shirt and a striped t-shirt. <laughs> That's so cute. I love how the stripes just stretch over her belly. This sim, by the way, is in the third trimester, so she is the biggest that she can possibly be pregnant. And there are just lots of different colors and patterns on these shirts. And here is the relaxed version, the ones with a combo. Oh, these are really gorgeous. I really love the colors and patterns that we got out of these. Nice job. That's gorgeous. So these clothes are only going to be wearable by a sim who is pregnant. So unfortunately, if you have a random adult sim who is not pregnant, even though these are super cute tops, that adult sim who is not pregnant will not be able to wear them. And here are the trousers mixed and matched in. Different colors, basically just cargo style. Yep, and here are the shorts. <laughs> I like that leopard style. 
pineapples, stripes, watermelon, these are white shorts, and these are kind of spotted black shorts. These are some really great looking clothes. Now let's check out the section of the maternity store for furniture and decorations. There are going to be two possible themes, nautical at the top here and contemporary. And as you can see, there are going to be 30 possible items in each of these themes. They are going to come in sets. There are two sets in the nautical and two sets in the contemporary as well. And the first set consists of eight possible items. To begin with, there are one, two, three, four, five items which you can buy, and if you buy all of those, you will unlock this prize set over here on the right, and that will come with an additional three items to make eight total. Once you have bought everything in set one and unlocked the extra prizes on the right, you will then be able to start buying stuff in set two, the grayed out row over here. So this row will have 22 possible items. It looks like to begin with, there are gonna be 14 items to purchase. And once you purchase all of those, you will then unlock the grand prize over here, which is an additional eight items and the contemporary set will work the same way. I'm going to basically go through and buy everything, and I've set up some rooms where I will model everything. So let's start out with set one of nautical. We'll just go ahead and buy, looks like an oak floor, and a navy wall, and blue rope rug, and black wall light, and a red mobile. And that now has unlocked the prize, which is those three extra items. And having bought all of the first row, we can now start to work on the second row. Like I said, this will be 22 possible prizes once you have unlocked the grand prize at the very end. So let's go ahead and set up room number one with all of the stuff that we've unlocked in set one and then I'll go ahead and buy set two and we'll set up an additional two rooms. And I'm just buying them here so that you can see what the prices will be. The first one is free and then after that, the prices will be a mix of simoleons and LPs and also social points. So this is room number one set up with the eight items that we unlocked in set number one. There will be more items to add to this once we unlock all the stuff in set number two. But to begin with, we've got a changing table, we've got nautical style paintings, and we've got a nautical style bookcase, which I think is, oh, so adorable. Look at that, it's got a baby monitor in there as well. And then over here is that lamp, the changing table, off the side, we've got some items for changing, I guess. And then there's this rug here and a mobile above. So let's pop into the store and start working on set number two. We'll get a dark brown floor, an off-white floor, an off-white wall, pastel mint wall, a gray rope rug, blue paintings, green paintings, gold wall lamp, and then a rose gold wall lamp, a metallic mobile, and a pink mobile, dark change dresser, an off-white change dresser, and a dark brown bookcase. And that'll unlock the grand prize. So like with set one, for each of the items in set two, the first one will be free, but after that they'll cost either simoleons or LPs or social points depending on the item. I'm just gonna quickly scroll through all of the possible items in the nautical theme so that you can see what they all cost, and then I'll do a quick show of the three different rooms that I've set up. I've set the three rooms up identically so that you can see what they look like side by side. In the first room, I've swapped out some furniture pieces to mix and match a bit better in my opinion, but you can mix and match in your own towns however you like. What we've got here is a white rocking chair with ottoman with dark wood, and so I've swapped out furniture over here for a dark wood version of the changing table and the picture frames. 
and the bookcase, and there's also a crib. In the second room, we've got beige walls and a darker wood floor. The rug here is gray and beige rope, and there's a rocking chair here. This version is dark leather on top of natural wood accents. So I've gone with the natural wood changing table here, the natural wood frames, bookcase, and crib. And there's that gold wall light. In the third room, we've got mint pastel green on the walls, a lighter natural wood on the floor. The rug is green and beige. The rocking chair is green leather on top of white wood. So for the changing table and the frames and the bookcase and the crib, I've gone for the white wood as well. And here's that rose gold wall lamp. Now let's go for the contemporary style. In set one, we've got one, two, three, four, five to begin with. That will unlock three more items, so eight total items in set one. And that means in set two, we'll have the same deal as with the nautical. Looks like 14 items to begin with, and then that'll unlock a grand prize with eight additional items. So let's go ahead with set one. And I'm just gonna go ahead and buy all of them in set one and set two, and then just decorate and show you how they can be set up. After buying everything in set one, we now can buy things in set two. So that's everything purchased for the contemporary style. So just like with the nautical theme, for each of the contemporary items, the first one will be free, and then after that they will cost either simoleons, LPs, or social points. And I'm just scrolling through so that you can see what the different prices are for the different items. And also, like with the nautical style, we have three different color themes going on for contemporary. The first color theme is green and goldish, so that is the contemporary style rocking chair. We've got an overhead lamp as well as the baby mobile. And then over here we've got their bookcase in a contemporary style. Similar types of items as the nautical, I think. Here's the wall hanging over the crib. We've got fox art as well as a stuffed fox in the crib. And then here's that changing table. In room number two, we have a blue and pink theme. Here's the rocking chair, the lamp, the overhead. Here's the bookcase. And the art is also a fox style, so that's really cute that it keeps there. And there's the changing table. And then in room number three, a pale pink and gray theme. So here is the rocking chair for that, and the rug overhead lamp, the mobile, here's the bookcase, and the crib, the art, and this time we get a pink fox compared to an orange one in the other rooms, cute. And then here's that changing table. So all of this stuff is super cute, I think. It will probably take a while to earn enough of the maternity store tokens to buy every single one of these. For the total amount of maternity store tokens we paid for all of this, I think I'm gonna have to go back and look at the footage, but I'll try and flash up the number on screen here. This is just for us in this temporary preview version of the game. It could be different in the version that you guys have once the update goes live, so please don't take this as, you know, the definite number. We're not sure. And the game developers, they can change things whenever they want but I think they've done a really good job with the artistry of all of these items. I cannot wait to have some newborn babies in town who will enjoy all of this stuff. Sims setting up their nurseries I think will be super cute. So please let us know guys what you think, and in the meantime, if you are new to our channel, feel free to subscribe because we've got plenty more Sims free play on the way. Thanks for watching.